What's up, cinema lovers, and welcome to another episode of Two Eye Cinema. I am your host, Jerem. And here on Two Eye Cinema, you know I like to give my opinion on some of the most popular pieces of cinema in the world. In today's episode, I'm going to be doing a run-through and review of Alice in Borderland, Season 1, Episode 5. Now let's get into it. On that note, don't forget to check out our merch options provided by KLB Supply at klbsupply.com. Follow Too High Cinema and KLB Supply on Twitter and Instagram at Too High Cinema at Too High Club and KLB Supply. Now let's get back into it. Arisu and Usagi, looking for the beach, secretly follow a group of players with similar risk tags to a hotel housing many players. They, however, are found and taken to the place's leader, Hatter, who confirms they have made it. Hatter says the beach's mission is to collect all the cards, which they believe will allow them to leave the city, but that the face cards have yet to appear. Arisu and Usagi are tasked with joining groups of players to collect the remaining cards. Later, Hatter reveals to a group of executive members, including Arisu, who participated in a game as a test from Anne, that the only remaining number card to collect is the Ten of Hearts. All right, likes. So the beach is real. It's wild as hell, but real. But <laughs> this shit still doesn't make sense. There are a lot more people playing these games, and they all experience everyone else around them disappearing at different times. Uh, so the people at the beach uh, think where they are is another country. Well, hence the visas, but I'm still confused on how something so elaborate <laughs> could be pulled off. Yo, I think all the games that involve animals, I would have been done. Or the one where you have to find the numbers on the wall in the dark room and you only get nine matches to use to find it. Like, who came up with these games? Yo, I laughed so hard, though, <laughs> when that girl thought it was smart to be the test dummy in the light bulb game. Also, I would have gotten tired of that song they played in the background of, uh, like, every happy scene uh, a long time ago. Uh, my favorite episode so far, though. Uh, so not a grading. But now for comedy, I'm definitely going to give a dank. Drama, dank. Action, dank. Horror, dank. Thank you again, cinema lovers, for watching this video. Please like, subscribe, and place the notifications bell on all if you want to see more content from us. Comment below to suggest any content. Follow us at KLB Supply, at Too High Cinema, and at Too High Club on all social media platforms for updates. And for now, smoke you later.